Hello there. Hey guys, Maelstrom here. If you're looking for the best part break build, you found the perfect video. First, take a normal target or momentum pommel build with Hellion Bond. Now change it to Emberman Bond. Swap Wild Frenzy to Overpower and done. You have the best part break build. Wow! Alright, little explanation. When it comes part breaking, there are four weapons which excels in it. X, Chain Blades, Sword and Warpike. With Warpike if you want part breaks just do not use Acidic. With Axe you have to use Sharpen since Axe have big number hits. And with Chain Blades you can also just take Emberman Bond. But Sword. Sword is a little different. Same, but different. Why? Because of Momentum Pommel. Emberman unique effect on Sword gives 250% extra part damage on the 6th hit. Pommel is a 6 hit combo, which means if you can spam the same combo without any interruption you always get the extra part damage on the biggest hit. But what if you have to start with an interrupt or have to dodge? Maybe because the parry resets the combo and also counts as an attack? Do no worry about that, just keep watching the number for the effect. If you cannot see it, that means you can do the pommel combo. If it's on 1, just do a full light attack combo to reset it to 0. If you see 2 on the bar, then do a full heavy combo to reset it. Otherwise just spam pommel and hope it will land on 0, 1 or 2 after a dodge or a parry. Before testing it on the field, let's see some dummy DPS. First, the normal Hellion Pommel Sword. You can see the health damage is almost the same as the part damage, the DPS is 1290. Next. With Emberman Bond after dealing 100,000 health damage the part damage is over 160,000, so 60% more than the dealt health damage. Probably you're not going to get the Ember Unique on every pommel finisher or parry, but you can see it's significantly increasing the part damage. The DPS is a bit lower, only around 1130, but let's see the difference of the two builds kill time. It seems like Emberman's kill time is barely slower than Hellion's and it deals much higher part damage. If you're going for kill time I'm sure Hellion with Whistling is stronger, but for part farming Emberbond with Pommel seems great. Let's see another run, but now just the Emberman one and count the amount of breaks.
Thank you guys for watching. Have fun with all those drops.